Hello, hi guys. Okay, so if you landed on this video, that means that you have been desperately, or like you've just tried to, you've just started to look into it, um, to update the firmware for your 12 to 35 millimeter lens from Panasonic Lumix. I have a Panasonic G Lumix and all yesterday I dug into this. Initially I just wanted to make a video about the problem because there's so many of us, there's a lot of us, so I, I wanted to reach out to other people and maybe get a reply, but I said, hey, why not make a video about uh, the actual response? I have gathered a lot of information from a lot of groups. Um, I find that Facebook groups are very, very useful in doing this, um, like Panasonic G, Lumix groups and all that, they're very good. So if you have any problem of any kind, just join those groups and the people that are so helpful. And like, if anybody's watching this, thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> you guys really, really helped. Okay. So basically, um, in my quest of updating my firmware, I found out the following. So how? How do you do it first? Okay, so th these are the steps to updating your firmware. You you go to Google, you just put in your um, Panasonic Lumix lens type. Okay, so 12 to 35 millimeter lens, Vario 2 f 2.8. Okay, and then you put software upgrade or firmware upgrade. Okay, and it should lead you to the website. And on the website, you will find zipped files. You extract the file inside the zip file. It's filed too many times. Anyway, <laughs> you extract the file and with the extracted file, you go to the SD card. So you take the SD card of your camera, you copy paste this onto the SD card, and then you insert the SD card into the camera. And then you just press the playback button. The, okay, I have a G8, Panasonic G8. So for me, it's the green button, the green button, play, playback. And it should go into would you like to update kind of you know screen but for me it was so annoying that annoying error no valid photos to display i tried everything i tried doing it faster i tried different sd cards i tried having you must have your battery uh, fully charged like if if you if it will work for you eventually and it's one of these other things like your battery is not fully charged or you don't have the right sd card or you just need to have your battery fully charged just know that or else it's not gonna work anyway so that's one reason uh, but for me, it was the fact that they do not make it. They don't make the update yet, okay? Because I have the second, like I have the Mark II of the lens. If you have the Mark I, it will work for you. If you have the Mark II, it will not work for you. So that's, so that's why it didn't work for me. <laughs> and once I found that out, I felt enlightened. Hallelujah! So, <laughs> once I found that out, um, I was my quest was actually to get the perfect setup for the perfect stabilization as I have to uh, video moving targets on a daily basis and obviously my videos were a bit shaky and I was like, I just want to rely on the Adobe Premiere like stabilization. I would like to have my own stabilization because I bought the Lumix G8 because I know it has in-body stabilization and I bought the 12 to 35 millimeters because I know it has stabilization as well. So I said, I'm not able to use stabilization. I went into the, the screen and the handshake was gray, which basically means you cannot select it. And I was like, what? No. So um, that's what, what, you know, I've set, up, set out on this quest of, of finding out why is my handshake gray? And then I found out that I was on a 4K shooting. It was set to 4K shooting. So in 4K shooting, you cannot have that. Okay, so uh, yeah, that's another thing. Take note, if your handshake or whatever other settings is off, it might be a 4K, it might be, there's a lot of like different settings that obstruct different other settings, so yeah. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, so in the end I ended up like ha leaving it as it is, like my, my lens is not updated, it's a one, it's a one, and I'm hoping they're gonna bring out the 1.3 because I know that's gonna be a lot better. And, Thank you um, for watching yeah. and please subscribe and comment and all these things, that'd be great, I really appreciate it and I just, what I'm about is really tech, fitness, travel, and life matters, which is about everything. So, um, <clears throat> yeah, I might be able to provide more content that should be to your liking, basically, whatever you're doing. <laughs> not actually, like, if you like soccer, I'm probably not gonna. But then again, if you like racehorses, I might. What? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, okay, have a great day. Thank you guys, and I hope this was helpful.